Hello friends, welcome back again. In this video we will see JavaScript interview question, event loop, how async really works. Ever wonder how JavaScript handles async tasks like set timeout or promises? It's all thanks to the event loop. Let's decode it in 60 seconds. What is the event loop? JavaScript is single-threaded, meaning it runs one thing at a time. But it handles async tasks using call stack, web APIs, callback queue, microtask queue, and the event loop. How it works, step by step. First code runs in the call stack. Then async tasks like set timeout are handed off to web APIs. When done, their callbacks go into a queue. The event loop waits until the call stack is empty. Then pushes the queued tasks back into the stack to execute. Console.log3 is a microtask, promise, runs before set timeout. Even with a delay of 0 milliseconds, set timeout goes to macro task queue. Micro tasks run before macro tasks. The event loop keeps async tasks flowing smoothly. It's what makes JavaScript non-blocking. Used in Promises Set timeout, set interval Fetch APIs Next, memory management in JavaScript, what causes memory leaks and how to avoid them. We will see in next video. Please like, share and subscribe. Thanks.